To prevent the virus from spreading even more in Pittsburgh, the Pittsburgh Cultural Trust canceled the Three Rivers Arts Festival and dozens of other events. Pam Serrano is live tonight with the impact this shutdown is going to have on the trust, the vendors, and our entire city, really. Pam. Kim, one of the most popular events at the Three Rivers Arts Festival happens right here at Point State Park in that grassy field behind me where a huge musical stage is set up. It's definitely going to be surreal not having it take place this year, but the trust says they canceled the event more than two months ahead of time in direct response to the governor's continued restrictions. It's Pittsburgh's largest festival of the year, attracting hundreds of thousands downtown over 10 days. A 60-year legacy of arts and entertainment for the whole family. This is a real tradition in Pittsburgh. This is tried and true, and, you know, there We've been joking, like, is it even going to be summer if the arts festival doesn't happen? The Cultural Trust says its decision to cancel 100 events, including the iconic arts festival and children's festival, is a hardship for the arts community and city. The trust issued a statement saying, as we continue to follow the leadership of Governor Wolf and our public health officials, it is with a heavy heart that we have come to the extremely difficult decision to suspend additional Pittsburgh Cultural Trust events extending through June 14th. We really do think it's it's what's best and what's safest for the city. The trust says public safety is primary, but as streets and venues remain desolate, the continued economic impact will hit the city hard. And those folks come to the arts festival and spend their money, but they also park downtown, they shop downtown, they eat downtown. 375 artists as well as musicians and concessions Engineers turned the entire downtown space into one massive festival. Kind of grief right now. Um, like I said, I just I love the festival and everything about it. We'll get to experience it this year. Skyline photographer and father of two, JP Durol, says artists from all over will feel the impact. I was kind of crushed. It's it's kind of my my Christmas in, in terms of business. Um, it's my favorite week of the year. Now, the trust says, of course, they'd rather have art experience together, but in lieu of that, they will experience it on a digital space on social media June 5th through the 14th when the arts festival would have normally taken place, and they will look forward to a jam-packed 2021 Three Rivers Arts Festival. At Point State Park tonight, Pam Serrano, KDKA News.